Foss Lust next then for the Foss Lust Stayers Handicap. Another long distance race. A lot of long distance races this week over the jumps and the flat. This is two mile, three furlongs. This time 0 to 110. And the top one is Kuiping East for Vinnie Gerard. Broken Promise for Ryan Tamasebi. Tigava. Graham Clutterbuck. Nubo for Darren Thompson. The Windfile Ollie for David Hooley. Kokoza World for Mike Westwood. Lady Pyrene Jim Murray. And Lucky Rebecca Martin Leader. So eight of them this time. Over two miles and three furlongs, a strange distance. Foss Lass in Welsh Wales, and we're all in stalls. And away they go. And Broken Promise and Nubo are the quickest two out. They're sorting themselves out now, see where they want to be through the first few furlongs or so. Tigala on the outside for Grand Clutterbuck. Grand Clutterbuck likes a flat stayer or two, and we're we'll hoping that this one. It's going to provide him with some winners this season and it's quickly gone into a two length lead and the rest of the field seem happy to let Tigava have the lead so the horse with the four white socks in the lead then Tigava from Broken Promise in second Lady Pyrene is third and Lucky Rebecca was a multiple winner last season but hasn't done quite so well so far this season back in fourth and the rest of them are all in a line with Nubo probably just the back marker but Tigava is showing the way home and a long way to go yet leads by four lengths to Lady Pyrene and Broken Promise Lucky Rebecca Royal Ascot winner last season in fourth then comes Kokoza World and Windfall Ollie Kai Ping East and Nubo the back marker you can see the hurdles course on the inside of the chase course on the inside of that as they come up past the stand then now we're passing the winning post shortly with a complete circuit of Foss last to go and Tigava has now probably gone six lengths clear of Broken Promise in second Lady Pyrene is shading that one on the outside then a gap of a couple of lengths to Lucky Rebecca and then the back four are in a line aren't they almost playing the offside truck back four and it's Kokoza World Windfell on it uh, keeper at Kuiping East and Nubo very interesting as we see some jerky video there to see whether Vinnie Gerard has managed to breed that blistering turn of foot that some of his sprinters have got into his stairs because if he has done we'll watch that Kuiping East explode about the two furlong mark but Tigava is currently in the lead and is currently clear By about four lengths. Water, water in the uh, in the system, I think, to free up the video. But Tigava is in front. Lead is down now. It's a little more than two and a half. So broken promise in second. Lucky Rebecca and Lady Pyre in with a share of third. Then wind fell Ollie after that one. And then Nubo, Kuiping East, and finally Kokoza World is the back marker, but all still pretty close. Plenty close enough if good enough. Just a neck in front there, Tigava. Broken Promise is in fact now going to go and take it up, I think, on the outside with less than seven furlongs to go. Broken Promise, the first one to make a move. Lady Pyrene is also trying to run on, and Lucky Rebecca has been given the hurry up by the jockey. Broken Promise in front. Tigava still got the rail though. Will have a significant advantage coming around this turn. Lady Pyre in third, Lucky Rebecca fourth. Everybody's under a little bit of pressure, it would seem, apart from the lead in three. But it's Broken Promise in front still. And Tigava on the inside is going to try and come out of this turn in front, I think. And Lady Pyre being pulled out for a challenge. Lucky Rebecca trying to decide whether they go on the inside or the outside of Lady Pyre. The bigger question might be whether she's got the pace to get past that one. Running on well is Windfell Ollie and Nubo. But now Broken Promise as they begin to straighten up has kicked on again now. And it's suddenly a length and a half clear again. Tigava's back in second. Lady Pyre will run in third. Then Windfell Ollie and Lucky Rebecca. Nubo is making good ground as well. Here comes Kaipinis. Has it got that? Vinnie Gerard speed. It's Broken Promise in the lead. Broken Promise is in front by 
two lengths to Tigava in second, then Lucky Pyrene is back in third, but it's Broken Promise who's still clear, then racing down towards the final third of Broken Promise, and looks like they're going to have to sprout wings to catch this one, Broken Promise is well clear, Tigava's trying to get a second win, Lady Pyrene coping is looking for Becca, they're all one paced, and it's Broken Promise who's clear, and Broken Promise who's going to hang on and take it, Broken Promise wins it, Tigava is going to be second, Lady Pyrene third, and then Coping is four, Nubo after that one, and Kikoza World was the last one to finish. And Broken Promise took that one really uh, six and a half furlongs out, made its move early, and none of them looked like getting to it at all after it went clear in the straight. So a good win there. Let's get a full list of the connections. Another one from Ryan Tamasebi. And there it is then. Broken Promise for Ryan Tamasebi is the winner. Tagava for Graham Klutzbuck was second. Then Lady Pyrene for Jim Murray third. Kai Piggy for Vinnie Gerard fourth. And Nubo for Darren Thompson was fifth.